Hello, this is the design of electronic lock. It is the most radical demonstration of this series. And to best take advantage of this project, we recommend you understand the previous video in this series before. It may be useful for device that require unique unauthorized use by those who knows the default code. The circuit used two pairs of four-way DIP switches. The code is set using DIP switches DIP3 and DIP4. Then these two switches are hiding inside the assembly. With DIP3 and DIP4, up to 256 code combinations are possible. The unlock code is set by the user using DIP switches DIP1 and DIP2, which is compared with the previous code entered earlier via DIP3 and DIP4. If the two codes match transistor T1 conduct, the codes are compared using two cascading 4-bit magnitude comparator IC, IC1 and IC2. If the input nibble present in DIP1 matches with present DIP3 nibble, output pin 6 of IC1 connect to input pin 3 of IC2 goes high. Now, if nibble present at DIP2 matches with the present nibble at DIP4, pin 6 of IC2 also goes high. This high output drive transistor T1 and the appliance turns on via relay contact. After use, disturb the position of, of DIP1 and DIP2 so that the appliance can't be operated by an authorized person. This will also switch the appliance off. The circuit works off a 5 volt DC power supply. Hiding switch DIP3 and DIP4 can be used to manually turn on of the appliance. If you have forgotten the preset code, caution, you may use this code lock at your own risk. After all, a clever intruder will try all 256 possible combination one after the other to break the secret code. Thanks for watching this series of three videos. If you like, give a yes to publicize this channel. Thankful. Bye.